My name is Mark Ellis. Um, I was involved in an incident in May of 2016. That incident resulted in me having my leg, my right leg, amputated 15 centimetres above my right knee as a result of being run over by a side loader forklift. The particular day that it happened, one of the salespeople from upstairs asked me to check on a particular product in the warehouse. So I went out into the warehouse and to find this particular material, I took one step backwards and the forklift appeared from nowhere and collided with me. The next thing I remember was though it took me off to Liverpool Hospital. The surgeon standing on the other side of the bed said to me, Mark, I think I've only got one choice, is to amputate. 53, 54 years of age, I had to learn to walk again and that was the hardest thing. Scary, difficult. It's had a huge impact on my wife, you know, almost as much as me. Our whole operation was closed down for four days to make sure that all those work colleagues had mentally recovered to some degree that they were able to get back to work. How am I going to go back and work with my work colleagues that saw what they saw? And I know to this day it has a huge psychological impact on them. The easiest way to avoid incidents like this is to keep pedestrians as far away as the forklift as they can, always outside the exclusion zone, and must remember that the forklift driver may not see you. So you need to make eye contact with the driver so that he knows you're there and you know that he knows you're there. When loading or unloading a vehicle, you need to be trained and authorised to do so. There is no job so important that it can't be done safely.